Hi, this is Donna and this is Jen and we're with Mille Lacs Band Public Health and we are going to show you and demonstrate how to wear masks properly and how to use gloves and how to dispose of them properly. So there's three different kinds of masks. The masks that are the N95s that you hear about look like this. These are for health professionals. They are not what we're wearing out in the community. So if you're asking about wearing an N95 mask, it's um, really not what we need. We're wearing either a cloth mask, some people have paper masks, and then some people have the ones that you pull up on, like a scarf, and they pull up, up to cover their face as a face covering. So those are the kinds we're talking about. The reason we're wearing a mask is to prevent our germs from spreading to the others around us. And you wear a mask to protect me, I wear a mask to protect you. It's not so that I'm not going to breathe in something from out there. I'm protecting you from my germs. Okay, so Jen will show you how to wear a mask. The first thing you want to do is make sure your hands are clean when you put your mask on. So you can wash with soap and water or you can use a hand sanitizer. If you use your hand sanitizer, you just make, rub it, make sure in between your fingers, your thumbs, your fingernails, until it's dry. With a cloth mask or a paper mask like this, you're gonna take it, put it, make sure it covers your nose and your chin, put your ear straps on, and just pull it so it covers your whole face. Those kind have the uh, little metal piece in there to form it to your nose point is that you don't want to touch the front of your mask when you are wearing it. You want to keep your hands away. If you have to adjust it, just use your strings to adjust it. Um, uh, when you're taking it off, just touch your strings to take it off. And potentially you have germs on the inside of it, so you want to fold it to the inside and throw it in the garbage. You could wear a, a paper mask like that um, all day. You just don't want to wear it multiple days. This is the her cloth mask. It's a little different because she's got the strings going around the back of her head. Same thing, you put it on covering your nose and your, your chin, cover your whole face there. And then same thing when you take it off, you don't want to touch the front of your mask. And this one just fold together, throw it in, set it aside so you can launder it. So you could wear that one for a day, the next day put a clean one on. Um, that's about it for masks. When you take your mask off, you want to wash your hands again, just in case you had some germs and you got your hands clean again. You can wash your hands multiple times throughout the day. It's not going to hurt. All right. We also want to show you how to properly put on and take off gloves. So she's going to sanitize her hands, wash her hands with soap and water. Same thing. You're going to need to have them dry if you're putting gloves on. The purpose of wearing gloves is to protect you from touching germs. So if you're caring for somebody who's sick and you're doing some personal cares or you're picking up tissues or cleaning the bedroom, you can put some gloves on. You don't want to put gloves on and then go from doing a dirty job to something that's clean. Or if you're just cleaning the house, you don't want to clean an area and then keep your gloves on and spread potentially spread germs to another cleaner area in the house. So she's going to put her gloves on. Just slide your hands in there. They're, the gloves are clean, so you don't have to worry about how you touch them at first. After you've done your job and you're going to take your gloves off, you don't want to touch the outside of them. So she's going to grab them, pull it inside out, all the germs on the inside. Grab it on the inside of the glove. Don't touch the outside of it. And just throw them in the garbage. That's what you need to do. And wash your hands when you're done with dirty gloves because there could have been a hole. You could have gotten something through the glove possibly. So there you go.